great to see you again. We're here at Karen Norwood Travel and we are headed to General Coffee State Park. So General Coffee State Park does have camping facilities. There are water and electrical hookups, picnic tables, and grills. There's a comfort station in the middle that has hot showers and laundry facilities. And then they have a bunch of playgrounds around in the camping area. Most of the Georgia State Parks, you have to reserve online, and they give you a nice little map to look at, but you can't always tell what the campsite is like. Um, one of the things that we like to do once we've gotten settled into our campsite is to drive around the campground and see what might be some good places that we would like to camp the next time we come. That way we have a really good visual of that one has a lot of shade or there's a lot more privacy or this one is not next to the playground. Things like that that help us decide, you know, the next time we decide to camp at this campground. So we're a lot closer here. Let me show y'all my campground. This is my campground right here. And surprisingly enough, we are like right on top of one of the comfort stations. It does not look like that in the map, but hey, I'm gonna take it. Of course they have parking right here. And then they have a little book box. I think these are fantastic. So many of the campgrounds are doing this. They have books and they have puzzles and all kinds of stuff. See? Isn't that great? So happily, this one is kind of just your old school cinder block building. We have a washer and dryer. Uh, it looks like the dryer is out of order right now, but we have a sink out here and a nice bench and a little table to fold clothes and a phone, which is unusual. There's not usually a phone. And then of course, I don't video when anybody's in here, so nobody else is in here. So this is one of this older campgrounds, I can tell. They are building a new comfort station, but they're just started on it. So here's our, should be, nope, that's still a potty. Let's see, this should be a shower. Okay, so you have a nice little shower area. Oh, a bonus, you have a little shelf in the shower. Shower curtain, and you have a bench, and there should be, let's see, if I get all the way in here with you guys. Yep, and then you get a hook on the back of the door. But you do have a locking door, which is, is nice. I don't say that you need it in a campground, but it is nice. And then you've got your big sink, and they do have a fan going on in here, so that's really nice. But yep, just kind of an older, older campground comfort station. So I seem to have picked a campground that has another strange setup. So you kind of... This is how you would drive in. It's one of these drive-throughs. And that's how you drive through. There's our cute little camper and truck. And then this back part is where the picnic table and where all the electricity and everything is hooked up. So it's a little strange. Usually this is where our door is facing this area. There's a the comfort station in the background. But strangely enough the way this one is situated the all the electrical and everything is on a different side usually it's all on one side but there you go there's our little campground and as far as I know they just have this one um, big shelter they have of course the screened in porch for cooking and then they have the group shelter where it's either a big giant room or they've got a couple of separate rooms but it's handicap access as well so i think that's really nice and then they've got a big deck off to the side i think they said there's supposed to be a wedding here this weekend of course they've got some little paddle boats there that you can rent and some canoes you can use you just have to be careful they do have um indigo snakes in this area too so you just want to be careful there protected but you need to be careful so i thought i'd bring you back by the heritage farm that they have here at 
General Coffee State Park. And there's the little comfort station. And then they've got this first little building that we're gonna try and go into. I don't think people were as tall as they are now. Hmm. I don't think those tears are period accurate. Maybe that'll make it a little bit better for y'all to see. But we're inside the Meeks cabin and there's the fireplace. And very low ceilings. I think they do interpretations here because those chairs are not period accurate. Then we have our picnic table. And then there's a loft up above. The ceilings are higher in the attic than they are up down here. I bet. <laughs> See some daylight through the roof too. That's not good. <laughs> <laughs> well, it said it had been moved several times. Also wanted to point out in Georgia State Parks, they usually have everything as handicap accessible. Most everything that they can humanly possibly do, they make handicap accessible. So I think that's really a nice thing. General Coffee State Park also has Heritage Farm. It's a little living history farmstead and it has a blacksmith shop and a tobacco barn and a whole bunch of other buildings that you can look into. We did not hit one of the days where they were actually doing demonstrations, so it was an off day. But um, the animals were there for us to enjoy and it was just, just a great little area to walk around and enjoy the outdoors. that said it was a campground shelter. Not sure what that was. We came and checked it out, the door's unlocked, and they have a, um, there's a TV in here and a projector screen and all kinds of uh, tables and chairs. I'm loving the little succulents in the windows. My daughter would absolutely love those. Oh, and there be light.
you can come in and do what you want to do and set it up and just make sure you put it back nice and neat. I feel bad that maybe the tent campers didn't know about this. This might have been someplace nice for them to have come in. But it's got this big giant kitchen and they've got some board games up underneath here. It looks like they've got a CD player. Two big refrigerators. And a very nice kitchen. So you could come in here if you were struggling or if you were in a tent and it's pouring down rain like it happens to be doing today. But it's got all of your like utensils and supplies and everything that you would need. So. We can even have mixers. And, bake a cake. How about that? I thought it was just set up for, you know, if you wanted to have an event here or something. But this looks like you're welcome to come in here anytime. Like I said, the door's unlocked. So you're welcome to come in. That's a really nice feature that I have not seen at any other campground. And it has air conditioning in here too, it looks like. So we're all done with General Coffee State Park. It was fantastic, very quiet, just a really good campground. Um, the campsite that we got was a little strangely done, but they're not all like that. But I hope you liked this video. Please like and subscribe. If nothing else, put down in the description box uh, things you liked, things you didn't like, so I can make my videos better. I appreciate it, and I will catch y'all on the next one.